Hello. In this video tutorial, we'll take a look at how to add UG34 bolted covers to standard flanges in Compressed Build 7600. So here we have a pressure vessel with a 6 inch nozzle. I will right click on that nozzle to edit it. And then I'll select the button to add a standard flange. So I'm going to go ahead and select the 300 class welding neck. I will specify the gasket material. And then I'll come over here and include this checkbox to include a blind. Um, so prior to compressed build 7600, um, if we wanted to add a blind to a standard flange, uh, the assumption was made that that blind would be a standard one. Uh, now, however, we do have the ability to add a UG34 bolted cover instead. So I'll go ahead and select that. And clicking next will activate uh, our bolted cover dialog. If you've modeled a bolted cover before in Compress, uh, then this is the same window that you saw then. Um, I'm going to assume the default values and click next and OK. And this brings us back to the nozzle dialog. Uh, from here, if we wanted to make any changes to our nozzle, we could do that. Otherwise, I'm going to select next and OK. And we have our standard flange and our bolted cover attached to that nozzle. At this point, we can attach a nozzle to that bolted cover. So I'll demonstrate this by adding a nozzle. And I'll select the nozzle size. And we'll attach it to the end of bolted cover number one. Here, I'll input the nozzle length. And I'll complete the dialog. And now you can see that in two is attached to that blind on the standard flange. Thank you for watching this video tutorial. If you have any questions or would like to see a demonstration, please email sales at or call 941-927-2670.